guys, this is here, and today I'm bringing you another Minecraft tutorial. This tutorial is going to be on four of the most common mono stable circuits. They're used for quick pulses. Like, okay, so you guys are going to see. Whoops, can't see it from that angle. All right, so you're going to see I'm going to push this button, and then that redstone lamp is going to come on really quickly, and then go off really quickly. See, and the when the button is still the button is still in and the light turns on and then off in less than that time so this one is really easy to build if you guys want to pause the video you can but it's pretty much just a uh, a button or your input block into a repeater into a uh, regular piston to uh, with a sand block above it going into another re repeater and into your output these repeaters both have zero ticks or one tick, however you want to look at it. Alright, on to the next one. This one is a little bit... It... it I don't know what... I, <laughs> this one was just one that... It, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. It's pretty much the same concept as that. I'd rather use that one, but it's a little bit more expensive because you have to have the piston, but nah, 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 nah. it's not that much. <laughs> it's not that much more expensive. If you have enough for the redstone, I'm pretty sure you have enough for a spare piston. So, guys, see, button is still depressed in while it, the uh, lamp turns on and off in that amount of time. This one is... Pretty simple as well. It's your input with a uh, redstone torch on the top of that block, leading into a block with a uh, with downward with stair steps of redstone dust, with a repeater under uh, coming out of the input block with th three ticks on it, and then on the other side you have a redstone torch leading into your output. All right. On to the next one. This one is another pretty simple one. This is probably this. This one is if you don't. These next two are if you don't. If you don't care about saving space, but these two are the most simple. And it it it's more. These two are more simple than that one, but they don't take. Uh, they take up more space. So if you guys uh, like simplicity and easy to to remember, this is pretty much all you have to do. So push a button. It goes on and then off real quick. And once again, this one is more of an overhead view, actually. You have your input uh, redstone dust on top coming out uh, with a, uh, repeater on this, a repeater on the side set to three ticks. Also, you have a redstone torch coming out to the side. It, uh, and then coming out of the redstone torch, you have an L shape. And on the last block, it's up, it's raised up one with a redstone torch coming out. The redstone repeater is also leading into that block, so that one is pretty simple. Now this one is just like, it looks like a clock. It's got the same shape as the generic clock, so it's, once again, really easy to remember. You push this button, and it goes on and then off real quick. Bam. Bam. Just like that. Alright, this one is another overhead. You have your input, then you, uh, torch coming out of one side, redstone dust coming out the other. All right, two block or two redstone dust, and then a repeater set to four ticks. Coming out of the torch, you have one redstone uh, dust going into a repeater set to one tick, and both of those are leading into a uh, into a block with a redstone torch on one side. Actually, it could you could have three different outputs on this. Let me show you how you can do that. You can go like this, or you can go like this. Just like that, guys. You may even be able to go underneath. Let's see. Let's see if we can. Like that. Um, we may be able to, but it'll be like an in it'll be inverted. So let's put that right there. Nope, nope, you can't. You can't put it underneath. So you can put them right there or right there and all three of these would be uh they would all be different outputs whereas these ones only have one unless you come out to the side like this 
but you can also do that on all three of those. So if you wanted to total it up, you could have a total of this one counts as five, this one counts as three, this one has three. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to do the math. But that, they have more than you think. <laughs> so, guys, you could have a lot more you could have a lot more outputs than just the one but it's just it's more common with just one so anyways guys it's, I probably made that a lot more complicated than it should have been but anyways guys if you enjoyed the video please leave a like and also if you enjoyed the video please subscribe to stay up to date with my uh, tutorials and uh, let's plays I'm gonna be starting a few more series is this soon so stay tuned for those and I will see you guys in the next video.